In this work, we propose a method for improving out of distribution generalization of learned dynamics by learning pseudo metrics and constraint manifolds. Here is the problem statement. Given a training data set which composed by multiple offline trajectories and one online trajectory, we want to improve the accuracy of dynamics prediction in the OOD range, which is close to online data set. The left hand side picture are the example data set for unicycle and quadro system. Our method has three parts. First is dynamics learning. By learning distance pseudo metrics from offline data, we reduce the input space for a trained dynamics model, resulting in enhanced OOD generalization. The second part is constraint learning. Based on the learned dynamics, we can generate approximate constraint data, which is accurate in the training range. With the pseudo metrics for the constraint, we can learn the constraint manifold by Gaussian process. Gaussian process has a good generality based on its kernel property. We can select the proper kernel for constraint manifold by the offline and online data. The third part is evaluation. We utilize the learned dynamics to make an initial prediction, then we project the prediction results onto constraint manifold to correct errors. Since the dynamics model and constraint model are distinct, this method offers flexibility in combining different learning methods such as new network and Gaussian process. We first evaluate our approach on a unicycle system. We show the rollouts of dynamics prediction following the online trajectory in PyBullet's environment. Compared to the baseline showing green, which is naive Gaussian process trained on the same data set, our method achieves similar accuracy for in-distribution data while improved prediction accuracy on all D range. We also test on noise data set after applying low pass filter, our method consistently outperformed the baseline cross different level of noise. We did the same test for the quadro system and get the similar results. We visualized the results in the Pebola system. The green line is the baseline predicted by Gaussian process and the blue one is our method, which is much close with the true dynamics. Similarly, we did a noise test for quadro system and the detailed quantity results is in the paper. We also test our method in the real world robot. Here is the demonstration how we collect data from the differential drive robot by the mocap system. The offline training range at the green line shows. The test data set follows online data set, which is out of training distribution. From the results, we can see for both noiseless and noise cases, our method has better performance than baseline. In summary, our work achieved better OD generalization by leveraging the sparsity of dynamics and the projection onto constraint. Thanks for your attention.